Welcome guys. On today's video, I'm going to be listing the top six application that you can use to screencast on your PC to your mobile or from a PC to a PC or mobile to mobile. So if you want to um, share a screen uh, from your mobile to your PC or from PC to your mobile, whichever one you want to do, or mobile to mobile, PC to PC, you can actually um, do this making use of this application. And before I dive in, guys, I want to quickly explain to you, um, this is actually screen sharing. It's very different from um, screencast device. Now, these are actually screencast device. Um, if you want to screencast, you actually need all of this device to be able to screencast. It's not very expensive. It's a bit cheap. So if you have this device, you can easily screencast and connect into the device. But then um, on this video, I'm actually going to show you um, the top five uh, application you can utilize to actually um, share your screen is also different. And also, um, sharing your screen is different from recording your screen. Recording your screen meaning recording what is happening on your screen. But sharing your screen means you either want to show the person what you are doing on that screen. And also, the person can also have the privilege of controlling your screen from another device and the person can be in us you'll be in nigeria it's going to work but for your um for your uh casting you actually need to be visible and you need to actually have access to this casting device before you'll be able to connect it and also screen recording is just record and then upload but screen sharing means the you want the person to be seeing what is going on that time and most of the times we use these programmers and designers probably you want to help somebody fix a bug on their system that is when you use all of this all right guys let me dive in by mentioning them so the first one on my list is called AnyDesk. now if you notice on my previous video i've already shown you guys how to use any desk so any desk works for all platform now when i say it works for all platform what i mean is that it works for windows which is windows operating system mac os android ios um, linus freebies raspberry pi and then chromebook but then um there is actually something about chromebook if you have the older chromebook um any desk might not work now what i mean is um when i click on this link for this any desk it's going to automatically bring me to the android play store i can use it right but there is a, actually a particular period where i do not have um a chrome laptop that has um a play store so guys this might not work for everybody making use of Chrome OS. Now, with that said, if it doesn't work for any, everybody, that means um, if you're using Chrome OS, um, <clears throat> consider making use of a different application that is not Chrome um, OS, or you consider purchasing a Chrome laptop that have access to this, or you just use a window, or you install a window to your Chrome, that will be easy. So the next on our list is called Team Viewer. Now Team Viewer, just like um, any desk, also very friendly and easy to use. It has very similar features. You can see it also on the same device with the other one. The only difference right here is that this doesn't have um, the free bees, I think. Look at it. So um, this free BSD um, operating system, um, I think, Team VR doesn't have it right now. So that is the only difference. But the rest of the thing, it works the same way. Um, if you watch my video on how to use any desk, you'll be able to know how to use Team VR also because they actually have the same functionalities. Now, the next one on my list is called Visor. Now, Visor is actually very easy to use, very friendly also. And it also have um, also its own kind of operating system. It works on your Chromebook. It works on Windows, it works on Mac, and then it works on Linux. Very easy, very um, very good software, and you can also get it for free. It also has a paid version, so you can also purchase the paid version if you are interested in that. Now, the next one is actually Miro TV or Mirroring App. Now, this is actually the one I did a tutorial on first before going into other one. So Mirroring um, application is also available on your Android Play Store, your Google, Amazon Store, and then um, it's on Hawaii App Store and also is on desktop and Linux. 
But um, so obviously on almost every platform, but the addition is that they also have it on Hawaii. So it's also very easy to use and also very smart application. I love that. Now, the next one on my list is actually Microsoft Remote Desktop. Now, this also works on your Chromebook. The reason why you know it works on your Chromebook is because you have this option right here. So once you click on it, you'll be able to download the particular application. And then guys, this is strictly for Microsoft, but I am sure it actually works for your, um, uh, your Google Chromebook also, because you also have an extension on Google Chrome. And now the next one that is actually perfect for a Google Chrome is actually Chrome Remote Desktop. Now this works for um, PC and it works for Chromebook. I am not sure if it works for Linux, it wasn't listed. But then if you have um, a Chrome browser installed, this is definitely going to work because it's actually an extension. So this is actually the last one on my list, but it doesn't actually make it worse or make it bad. Now, all of them has a very few or uh, unique features with them and also do not forget that most of them you actually need to pay to use the premium version but now um you can use the free version as well but if you have other jobs you want to do and you're not getting it right go ahead and pay, purchase the premium version and it's going to help you effectively so guys these are all the list of um of them and guys if you know how to use one particular one you will definitely know how to use the rest. And there is no fault in actually practicing and using them effectively. So let me know if this video helped you. And also, if it helped you, consider sharing the video. And also, um, you can still join my membership and subscribe to the channel. I really appreciate everybody that is already actively um, as a member. I am going to be releasing a sticker, special sticker for members very soon. So make sure you join the membership to get access to the special sticker. And that way I can know that you are in my membership. Whenever you leave a comment with that sticker, I can easily reply to your comment quickly than, um, than I do for others. But then I'm still going to reply anybody's comment anyway. I really appreciate. So thank you for watching. I will see you on my next video. Please stay safe and peace.